With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hi everyone. So we are given with a question which says we, uh, we have been given with a ring of mass small m and radius small r. Maximum gravitational intensity on the axis of the ring has value. So uh, we have been given with a ring. Uh, let's suppose this is the ring having a radius of small r and mass of uh, small m. And we have to calculate the maximum gravitational intensity at this point P. Alright, so we know about gravitational intensity at point P due to a uh, ring can be written as GP and that is equals to GMX divided by r square plus x square raised to 3 by 2. Let's suppose this is our equation number 1. So we need to calculate the maximum gravitational intensity. For that we will use the concept of maxima over maxima minima over here. That is in uh, differentiation of dg uh, with respect to x and equate it to 0. Alright, so therefore from here we can say uh, we can write we will apply u by v over here for differentiation. So this can be written as r square plus x square raised to 3 by 2 and differentiation of x is 1 minus of uh, x into 3 by 2 r square plus x square raised to 3 by 2 minus 1 that is uh, 1 by 2 into 2x and that is equals to 0. Alright, so from here we can say now therefore further if we resolve so we can get the answer as 2 and 2 will get cancelled out and what we are left with is 3x square into r square plus x square raised to 3 by 2 and that is equals to r square plus x square raised to here it is 1 by 2 and here it is raised to 3 by 2 all right so from here we can say therefore we are left with uh, this can be written as 3x square and that is equals to r square plus x square therefore from here the value comes out to be uh, 2x square is equals to r square from here the value of r will be uh, equals to or we can say the value of x will be equals to r by root 2 Alright, so this is the value and if you substitute this value in equation 1, so we can get the maximum value of it. Uh, now we can write from equation 1 GP that is at point P and its maximum value can be written as GM into X can be written as R by root 2 into R square plus x square can be written as r square by 2 raised to 3 by 2 alright so if you solve this value further so we can get the answer as gmr divided by root 2 into uh, this can be written as 3 r square by 2 the whole raised to 3 by 2 alright so if we resolve it further so we can get the answer as this can be written as finally gm divided by so here it can be written as uh, over here we are left with 2 gm upon 3 root 3 r square so this is what the value of uh, gravitational intensity maximum at point p we are getting so if we compare it with the option so we can clearly see option uh, C matches with the answer. So I hope you have understood the concept and thank you for watching. For class 6 to 12, ITG and NEET level. Trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download Doubt and App today.